Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is Lakshmi and you are watching a homemaker's fashion. Today I am going to show you how I am using two planners to plan functionally. These are my two planners that I use for planner. This is my disc bound planner that I set up using various insert. You can check that video in my channel. So now how I will plan is I have a sheet of paper and in that I will just jot down what are all the things that I have to do for the next week or the upcoming week and in that list uh, I will be uh, making that list uh, three days before Monday. And sometimes I will also add meal plan also and I'll be placing it in the week that I'm going to plan and then I will mark what work should be done in which day I'll mark it roughly on the same day itself And then this is my main planner and I'll be opening this each and every day starts. And this planner setup video is also in my channel. You can check that and I and also I'll be linking that in the description. Yeah, so this is my last week of June. So what I will do with this planner is first I will place the things which is 100% sure that I am going to do that on the particular day and I will leave some space for the things that will go on each day so I will be marking, I will be opening uh, when each and every day starts and I will jot down the things that I am going to do on that particular day which is not already marked and in the remaining place I will be using some uh, half box deco stickers and after the week over I, in empty space which is not filled and I will be uh, using some uh, decoration stickers and I will fill that place or space. I will do different types of planning using happy planner. This is one type of planning that I will do and in the next week what I'm going to do is I'm going to use three sections. I'm going to uh, differentiate or I'm going to split uh, uh, three sections and one is for to do for the day and second is for home and third is for work. So this is uh, 6 to 12 that is July 6 to 12. Uh, to do's that I have to do for the week and backside I have mail planning and also I have roughly jotted all the things for the each and every particular day the first thing that I always do in planning is I will select washi for the week and place it below I will always select the washi uh, in theme base because uh, according to the washi theme I will be using stickers, uh, functional stickers in my planner. So this uh, multi watercolor splash uh, theme washi is from my favorite shop Ananda Stores. I just love this washi. And this, uh, yeah, this uh, small emoji washi, I don't know how it, it is called. So this washi is also from Ananda store. You can check out their website or you can reach out there directly. I'll be linking their Instagram page. You can check out that. So as I said earlier, I'll be doing theme based every week. So. Uh, this orange color which is already in the week page is it is okay for me because it is uh, present in the washi the color the orange is already present in the washi 
and I have I decided to add some other color which will be bright so I selected this green color washi this a uh, skinny washi I think it is from Amazon I don't know but I bought this but it is available in Amazon and it is also available in Amazon store you can check that check it out now I use this green washi for uh, for some bright color for that to be on my page so next is as I said earlier I have split it uh, this page this week pages into three sections one is for to do for the day and next is for uh, home and third is for work Actually what I will do in the work section is I just jot down the students who are going to take class for today and also uh, I'll be uh, noting the points that, that is work related. I'll be having uh, 5 students on each and every day that is I'll be taking 5 classes on each and every day. And on Sunday, I'll be taking only two classes so that I'll be having only two students on Sunday. So now I'm placing functional stickers on the work section, uh, which I know that I'm going to do it on that particular day. And in this functional sticker, I just downloaded it from Pinterest and printed it and this is for my personal use only. So now I started placing functional stickers for the entire day for the work that I'm going to do for that particular day which is 100% sure. Now I placed two Hong Kong stickers on Tuesday and Sunday so for what I'll do is I'll be editing and editing on Tuesday and I'll be uploading on Sunday and on during Sunday I'll be filming the next video. And usually I'll be planning uh, my entire week uh, on Saturday. So I placed a, a plan a sticker that I downloaded from Pinterest and I printed it. Next I started jotting all the things that I have that I want to do on each and every day which is 100% sure. <laughs>
coffee yet Got no makeup How do you look so fine? Bust up, bust up How did I make you mine? Stay a minute, another minute Hold on a second I love this moment, yeah Stay a minute, another minute Hold on a second I love this moment, yeah And now I I started uh, jotting other things which is not 100% sure but I I am in a compulsion to do that on that particular day or it may change that is not 100% sure but it may change so I'll be noting that uh, without any stickers I'll be just uh, noting it down below under each section on a second love this moment Now on the left corner what I will do is I will be using that for mail planning. I will be placing these dot stickers. Uh, I just got this from Amazon I think so I don't know. And I will be placing uh, this dot sticker for uh, each and every day mail plan. Hold on a second, I love this moment, yeah. Just stay a minute, another minute. Hold on a second, I love this moment. And this might be a complete week, which is purely functional. I didn't use other deco stickers here. I used only functional box stickers and some checkbox stickers. Yeah, and that's it guys. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe. Stay home, stay safe.